So if I were to get this piece, the first step I would take would be to look up the opera itself. Find out a little bit about the opera, know who you are in the scene, what you want to achieve, and how you're going to achieve it. Find out what your relationship is to the other characters and what has happened in the opera before you start to sing. Know what happens after you sing. Find out who might be in the scene with you, or if you're alone, where are you? Then I would do a word-for-word -word translation of the text. It's easy to find translations these days online, but oftentimes they're poetic translations, which is great. But then you also want to make sure you do a word-for-word -word translation, so you know which part of speech every word is, you know exactly what each word says, so it's not a general understanding, but an exact understanding of what you're saying, so that we have that immediacy of connection to the text, and then we can communicate that to the audience. So once you've done that, you've done your research, then write out the text itself in its original language, and make sure you know how to pronounce the words. Again, that's something that you can get help with online. You can also get help from a dictionary or from a coach or a teacher or someone who's fluent in the language, which in this case is Italian. After you've done that, you start to speak the text out loud. Speak it dramatically, like a monologue. Not in the rhythm of the piece, but as though you were performing it a la Shakespeare. For example, L'ho perduta me meschina, a chissà dove sarà, a chissà dove sarà, non lo trovo, non lo trovo, l'ho perduta, meschinella, a chissà dove sarà. Once you can do that confidently and it's sitting well in your voice and your mouth and you're not stumbling, then you start to look at the rhythms. Speak the text in rhythm, perhaps a little under tempo if it's a faster piece, and get used to how that feels. For example, l'ho perduta. Me meschina, a chissà dove sarà, a chissà dove sarà. Now once that is comfortable, and so you've worked both the words and the rhythms, and you're not stumbling again, it's feeling smooth, then you look at the melody. And I would say, find what's easiest for you to phonate on, whether that's a lip trill, whether that's a tongue trill, that might be a hum. And we start there with the melody. For example, so then you started to work the melody into your voice, but again, we're layering one step at a time, almost like how you would prepare a delicate dessert. Instead of just throwing all the ingredients in there and hoping it comes out well, you're adding one at a time to make sure everything is ready. After you've done all of that, then you're going to put the words and the text together. Depending on how fast you learn music or how long you've been singing, this could happen in one day, it could happen over the course of several days, so that you make sure that each step is really, really solid. So then once you put it all together, you're going to start to look at the, what's happening in the piano as well. If you're singing with perhaps a string ensemble or an orchestra, you start to look at what is happening in the orchestration. That gives you more information about your character, about the scene, and helps you communicate even more efficiently.
plaintive minor melody here that gives me a lot of information before I even come in about what's happening from Genius Mozart. <laughs> finds out. All of that is encapsulated in these two pages. So although it's a short piece, I want to make sure that I take all of those steps to help me prepare this piece so it's as efficient and as communicative as possible when I go to sing it. So I look at the text, I research the opera, I research the scene in my character, I identify what I want from the scene, I speak the text dramatically, I speak it in rhythm, I hum or lip trill the melody, and then I put it all together, and I look at the other information the composer has provided with me, for me rather, in the accompaniment or the orchestra. Rejoice, 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 rejoice. 